Hello everyone. Today we will learn a new lecture, inter-VLAN communication. In last lecture, we talked about VLAN. We know that two devices in different VLAN cannot communicate with each other. They are not in the same broadcasting domain. Then how can they communicate? We should use inter-VLAN communication technique, which will be introduced in today's lecture. And today's lecture will be divided into four parts. In part one, we will first talk about the background of inter-VLAN communication. We will learn why do we need this inter-VLAN communication. So this is the background. You can see that uh, in real-world network deployment, actually different IP address segments are assigned to different VLANs. If a multiple PCs in one VLAN can communicate directly with each other through the layer 2 devices, for example, the layer 2 switch, we call this communication as the layer 2 communication. However, if one PC in one VLAN want to communicate with another PC in another VLAN, then we cannot only use layer 2 devices. Instead, we need to uh, we need the layer three devices to uh, support this kind of service. So this inter VLAN communication actually belongs to the layer three communication. So that they require the layer three devices. And what is layer three devices? Actually, the router is a typical layer three device. The layer three switch and firewalls are also layer three devices. So here, if we need to communicate between this computer and this computer, then first the traffic should be transmitted through the layer two switch. And then layer two switch should forward the packet to the layer three router's interface. And then the router will send the packet to another interface, which can finally reach the another VLAN. Then the packet is go through the switch and then finally to another VLAN, another PC. So this is the process of the inter-VLAN communication. We know that they cannot directly transmit it through the switch. They must go up to the layer three devices. Okay, so actually here, the communication packets are routed by the layer three device. 